Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to talk about how Elliot Page joins dating app. Let's get right into it. Elliot Page is officially on a dating app. The actor posted a photo on his Instagram story of himself looking at a phone with his Umbrella Academy co-star Ritu Arya. He captioned the story, at Ritu Arya, guiding me on my first dating app ever. The Juno star has been quiet about his love life after he separated from Emma Portner in January 2021 after three years of marriage. In a statement shared by the former couple, they announced they had decided to divorce after being estranged for a number of months. They said at that time, After much thought and careful consideration, we have made the difficult decision to divorce following our separation last summer. They then added, We have the utmost respect for each other and remain close friends. This news comes three years after the couple tied the knot in a secret ceremony, announcing the news via a photo of their wedding rings on Instagram in January 2018. At the beginning of December, Paige came out as trans on social media, announcing that his pronouns are he or they, and his name is Elliot. He wrote at that time, I feel lucky to be writing this, to be here, to have arrived at this place in my life. I feel overwhelming gratitude for the incredible people who have supported me along this journey. I can't begin to express how remarkable it feels to finally love who I am enough to pursue my authentic self. Portner, who is a professional dancer and choreographer, was equally supportive of the news, effusing on her Instagram page. Trans, queer, and non-binary people are a gift to this world. I also ask for patience and privacy, but that you join me in the fervent support of trans life every single day. Elliot's existence is a gift in and of itself. Shine on, sweet E. Love you so much. Paige talked about this in an interview with Oprah on Apple TV Plus's The Oprah Conversation, marking his first interview since coming out, saying, Why has society made getting to this place of my life? Because that's the situation we're facing. He then added, And yeah, it was probably driving my friends crazy, sending them profile photos of me post having top surgery and how different I felt after that and all this space. In April 2021, Paige told Vanity Fair he's known he's a boy since he was a small child. He said, All trans people are so different, and my story is absolutely just my story. But yes, when I was a little kid, absolutely, 100%, I was a boy. Paige then added, I knew I was a boy when I was a toddler. I was writing fake love letters and signing them, Jason. Every little aspect of my life, that is who I was, who I am, and who I knew myself to be. He then recalled, I just couldn't understand when I'd be told, No, you're not. No, you can't be that when you're older. Adding, You feel it. Now I'm finally getting myself back to feeling like who I am. And it's so beautiful and extraordinary. And there's a grief to it, in a way. When asked about dealing with negative reactions from strangers after coming out, Paige said, What I want to focus on right now, and has been so extraordinary, is the degree of joy that I feel, the degree of presence that I feel. Page said, Everyone deals with expectations, sort of limits and constraints in everyday lives, and there's an obsession over how we're supposed to live our lives. The actor added, To me, it'd be so special for us to all be able to connect and talk about how similar we are in all of our journeys. In a past interview, Page also admitted that he wasn't comfortable during the time his hit film Juno was at the height of its popularity. He said in a cover interview for Esquire's summer 2022 issue, I was closeted, dressed in heels, and the whole look, I wasn't okay and I didn't know how to talk about that with anyone. While he can't pinpoint a worse day, Page said, when Juno was blowing up, this sounds strange to people and I get that people don't understand. Oh, F you, you're famous, and you have money, and you had to wear a dress, boo hoo. I do not understand that reaction, he then added, but that's mixed with, I wish people would understand that that shh literally did almost kill me. It seems like Paige is getting more and more comfortable opening up more about his life and is even planning to release a memoir next year. Flatiron Books announced that the Umbrella Academy star will release his memoir titled Page Boy in 2023. The publisher said that the memoir will delve into Page's relationship with his body, his experiences as one of the most famous trans people in the world, and will cover mental health, assault, love, relationships, sex, and the cesspool that Hollywood can be. According to the Associated Press, Page will also discuss his acting career, which included an Oscar nomination for Juno in 2008, as well as his experiences in the transgender community. That's it for today. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to hit that like button. 
Don't forget to subscribe and turn on that notification bell so you never miss out on any future content we'll produce for you guys. We're signing off now, but we'll be sure to catch you all in the next one.